guys, today I'm going to share with you all about the Thieves dishwash detergent and what's the difference between this stuff and all the other stuff that's on the market. It's Elizabeth from Adair Green Moments. I'm so glad you're here. Make sure you click the link down below if you want to get started with essential oils and get a starter kit and have me walk you through this journey. I would love to be part of your life. So if you um, are new here, I love sharing about health, wellness, and essential oil. Join our little family. Click um, subscribe so you don't miss any more videos. And uh, today we're going to jump into what's the difference between this dish soap and the regular stuff out there. So I'm just gonna jump in. I have a green personality, which means I love to do a little bit of research so I can share with you guys um, what I've learned, but I don't have all the answers. So please let me know your tips, tricks, suggestions in the comments down below so we can all learn together. So the very first thing is this is 12 fluid ounces of dish soap. Retail, it's $18.09, and wholesale, it's $13.75. So you get a bit of a discount, like $5 um, off, but it's very concentrated. So you can get a foaming soap dispenser, put in about a tablespoon and the rest water, and it works wonderfully in your dishes. Now this is not for the dishwasher, it's for your dishes in the sink to hand wash. There are no chemicals, dyes, synthetics, SLS. It has plant-based ingredients. This girl loves that because I'm a vegetarian. Uh, it has the power of thieves, jade, lemon, and bergamot. Mmm, so nice. I love that combination. And it does work. So if that's one of your questions right off the bat, does this stuff still work because it's free of all of those junky stuff and chemicals that we want to avoid? It does, but it works best in hot water. Um, you don't get as many suds as you would from typical dish soaps that you can buy from, you know, your big box stores because a little bit goes a long way and we don't have that SLS. So the other thing that I love about it is that you can enjoy aromatherapy while you're washing the dishes and you can clean without getting a headache from those inducing artificial ingredients. So it's safe for your family, for your littlest of kids to wash the dishes. Now, what's the difference between this and all the other soaps out there and the things that I want you to look for when you're buying dish soap if you're not going to purchase this? You really want to look out for dish soaps that have chemicals, dyes, because our skin is our largest organ and we soak it right up. So if you're washing dishes with gloves on, you don't have to worry about your skin touching it, but you are breathing in what you're surrounding yourself with. So just be mindful of that. But you want to avoid stuff that has chemicals, dyes, SLS, synthetic per preservatives, um, which causes scrutiny for allergies and is found in many green household products. So even though you may be buying something that's green, green, healthy, <laughs> it may not be. A lot of those labels can be very misleading. So look at the back and see what are the ingredients in the back and make sure that it's stuff that you understand or you can start looking them all up online and just see. It's just important to be aware of what's in our home and what our kids are around. So one of those preservatives is, and I will put it here so you can see it, methylisothiazolanone. <laughs> I don't know how well I did, but that's one of the ones to really look out for. And they typically um, have a lot of suds because of that sodium lauryl sulfate. It's also an ingredient that's in like shampoos and toothpaste to really give you that sudsy feeling that we are used to, but those are not good for our health. So I just wanted to share with you briefly a little bit about the Thieves dish soap and what's the difference between this and all those other ones. This goes a long way because you only need a little bit, the rest water in a um, foaming dispenser, and um, you can wash your dishes and not have all those awful chemicals. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below if you've tried it, how you like it, and um, I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for taking the time to watch. I'll see you later. Bye.